Number five on your 1.1 and 1.2 quiz review has to do with graphing horizontal and vertical lines. Remember that vertical lines are lines that go straight up and down, and their equations have a special format. For a vertical line, the equation will always be x equals and then a number. And that number is going to be where the graph crosses the x-axis. We call that the x-intercept. Notice how this line here in this picture crosses the x-axis at 4. Since it's a vertical line with an x-intercept of 4, its equation would be x equal 4. Now, a horizontal line is a line that goes straight across from left to right. And the general form for a horizontal line is y equals a number, where that number is the y-intercept. That's where the graph crosses the y-axis. In this picture, you can see that it's crossing the y-axis at negative 2. So the equation for this line would be y equals negative 2. All horizontal lines will be in the form y equal a number, and all vertical lines will be in the form x equal a number. Let's match each graph to its equation. Notice how number 1 is a horizontal line. Horizontal lines are always y equal lines. And you can see that this crosses the y-axis at 2. So its equation would be y equal 2. And we would just drag and drop that there into number 1. Equation number 2 is a vertical line. Notice how it also crosses at 2, but 2 is on the x-axis. Well, vertical lines are always x equal, and since it crosses the x-axis at 2, this would be x equal 2. So I would go ahead and drag and drop that there to number 2. Then if we move down to graph number 3, it's another vertical line. So it's going to be x equal, but this time it crosses the x-axis at negative 2. So it will be x equal negative 2. And then our last equation, we're back to a horizontal line. Horizontal lines are always y equal, and you can see that this time its y-intercept is negative 2. So the equation would be y equal negative 2.